comes to that World Cup time, some people tend to change up their hairstyles. From England fans dyeing their hair blonde like Phil Foden, to fans even shaving their hair into a shape of their favourite player like Messi. But there's only one particular haircut that is the most famous of them all, and it's every mother's worst nightmare. Yes, that's right, I'm talking about the famous R9 haircut that every kid seems to want to get every four years. But let's get into the real reason Ronaldo got that unusual yet iconic haircut. Let's take it back to the 1998 FIFA World Cup final, where Brazil took on France. Ronaldo had high expectations and a load of pressure on his shoulders from the media. But this pressure became too much for Ronaldo and resulted in him having a seizure hours before the final. But despite his health condition, Ronaldo still ended up playing that game but was sadly runners up by taking a loss of 3-0. Four years later and the 2002 World Cup in Japan had arrived. But the time between both competitions, Ronaldo had been having many injuries which limited his playing time. And due to this, the media and fans were questioning his chances of playing the World Cup. But Ronaldo did end up being taken to the World Cup and even won Brazil their fifth title, with Ronaldo scoring both goals in the 2-0 win over Germany in the final. But it wasn't his football skills people were talking about, but rather his particular and distinctive haircut choice. Football fans around the world were super confused as to why Ronaldo had three quarters of his hair missing with just a quarter done at the front making it look like a flat cap. Well, 16 years later, Ronaldo came out to reveal all about why he really got that haircut. The real reason for this haircut was down to the fact that people were focusing on Ronaldo's injury scare and Ronaldo didn't like this so he decided to get this iconic trim in order to distract the media's attention away from the injury. And to be fair to him, it worked! Football fans thought he may be doing this to pay tribute to the Brazilian cartoon Turma de Monica by getting the haircut similar to one of the main characters from the show. In an interview with Copper 90 back in 2018, here's what the man had to say himself. Did the haircut play a part in winning that World Cup? Two years early, I get this. Uh, a huge injury that could make it stop forever playing football. So I was just cutting my hair. Like so, I came to training with that hair. Everybody was talking about the hair and forgot about the injuries. So that helped me a lot in that time. Ever since that day, kids and even adults around the world have been getting this done when it comes round to that World Cup time. So will you ever get this haircut? Subscribe right now and let me know down below in the comments if you will be.